don't usually like cheating either, but I'm not gonna lie, it felt really good being in that bitch. <laughs> What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. It is Logan Turner here and today is going to be a fun one. We're going to be training at a different gym today. We're going to be seeing Black Panther and we're going to be eating of course lots of bad unhealthy food. So I'm going to take you guys through that. This should be a fun vlog. Right now I'm eating my first meal of the day and I have five whole eggs and a banana with some coffee of course. It is 740. I got to go to work at the gym and I get off at 12. So I will see you guys when I get off at work. So I just got home, got off work, and I'm eating my second meal of the day. So all I got here is six ounces of chicken breast. And so this is what I do every time I know I'm gonna have a cheat meal. That's why it's important if you are gonna have a cheat meal to plan ahead, but sometimes life just gets thrown at you. But when you can plan ahead, it's best to do it. If you know you're gonna go out for dinner later, um, just what I do is I eat protein mostly throughout the day and then I save all my calories pretty much other than protein for later in the night. And what that does is helps me guarantee that I still get my protein in because you know protein is important to building muscle. And I won't go too far over my calories, but the way I eat, I probably will still go pretty far over. But that just saves me a couple thousand calories because I will not, I haven't eaten really any carbs yet today other than banana. And I'm gonna eat again here before I leave for my appointment as like a little pre-workout meal. I'm gonna have like three, four packets of oatmeal and a protein shake just to, once I, again, get that protein and then I want a little bit of carbs in me for the workout. So, as I already told you guys, I was gonna save a little car, or have a little bit of carbs before we leave so I have some in me for the workout. So I got four packets of oats here with my normal toppings, but I don't have peanut butter in it because I'm saving my fats and carbs because I already told you guys, it's fucking, huge cheat day. We're gonna just go off the rails today. Then I have a protein shake, as I said before. I haven't had oatmeal without peanut butter in it and I don't even remember how long. So, this should be interesting. He's about the mouth, fuck it. Large and subs, let's <laughs> The new shaker cup. <laughs> this shit's harsh, man. See, your scoop is big? Yeah, dude, that one's the same size, I think. Mine's bigger. It's done. All right, so we got some pre. We got about a five, 10 minute drive to the gym. We'll see you guys after the workout. Peace.
workout still is hitting me. But you guys understand, like I don't like to be a cheater, but I cheated on my gym today. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. I'm just, <sighs> but you I wouldn't say I'm disappointed in myself, but fuck that bitch. No, I'm just kidding. But we're about to cheat on our diets too. We're about to go eat like fucking three larges, you know? It's probably never a good idea to, I like I said, you want to plan your cheat meals and do it after you work out because that's the best time to cheat. Testosterone's through the fucking roof, you know? You're going to burn that shit off a lot easier. But we're about to go eat like three fucking larges and get some froyo, so I'm pretty damn sure that this is probably not how you guys want to do your cheat meal, but you guys know me. I don't do anything the simple way. What do you got to say, bro? I don't really usually like cheating either, but I'm not gonna lie, it felt really good being in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously though, that was a fucking killer workout. I like come, I like switching it up every now and then. You know, I haven't been here for, since the summer probably. They got a lot of machines our gym doesn't have, so we're about to go eat a hell of a lot of pizza, and I will see you guys when we got our food. I really think I could be a competitive eater if you know this fitness fitness thing doesn't work out. Here's some gummy. Don't you think, Sue? Don't you think so, bro? Oh, that's pretty impressive. Tell them how I ate. Man. Well, you only ate like a quarter of the food. <laughs> that's what he did. I think I might have ate like two of the largest. Let's be real. This kid can't eat. Yeah. Anyways, you know what? You guys already know. We're going to get Froyo, so let's keep this train rolling. I don't know how I'm not 700 pounds still. This is mine versus his. Mine was nine dollars, his was five dollars. Um. All right, so we just smashed some Froyo. I'm just saying guys, you can, just by these cheat days I have, you guys can easily tell how the fuck I weighed 350 pounds. Don't you agree? Yeah. It's pretty sad, honestly, that I can eat this much. I think I'm gonna stroke out. <laughs> I don't think my appetite has decreased one bit since I lost all that weight. One difference is I work out a lot more and I don't eat like this every day. This literally was like how I ate every day. So this is kind of like a day in the life of my 340 pound self, even though I'm not 340 anymore. We're going to the movie though. We gotta pick up some candy, of course. So we'll see you guys in Walmart or wherever we get the candy. All right, so we just went to Dollar General, picked up about $6 worth of peanut M&Ms. We got two sharing sizes because we're gonna share with ourselves each pack. <laughs> God. I am so fat. So we're gonna go watch the Black Panther. I'll let you guys know my opinions on it. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be good. I love superhero movies. So I will see you guys after the movie. What's up guys? We just watched the Black fucking Panther. That shit was so good. <laughs> He doesn't mean a fucking cuss. <laughs> <laughs> nah, no, I'm just kidding, dude. Black Panther, 10 out of 10. <clears throat> Best superhero movie I've seen in a while. It's a big size thing, it was a really good movie. <laughs> at 11.40 right now? It's 11.40 at night. We probably took in about 7,000 calories a day. No, I did. You probably took in about five. All right, and then so this. Yeah. We're, we're, we're not done eating. I'm not done eating yet, so. He's still gonna go eat some fucking cereal when he gets home. Yeah, because I'm, I'm just, I'm really fat. And honestly, like, I should have just made this the 10,000 calorie challenge because it would have been easy. I could easily do 20 in here. What if I did a 20,000 calorie challenge, guys? You think you could eat 20,000 calories in one day? Yes. Dude, I eat like 500 before I started eating it. And I didn't eat till like six. And I'm at like 7,000 already in like, Five, four hours, three hours. Dude, it'd be a push for me to make 10. You could make 10 if you started early. But we're gonna go home and play some goddamn Fortnite. We're gonna search some chests, hopefully find some golden scars. So I didn't show you anything about Fortnite because you know, the best we placed was like top five. Then we of course died every time. It's kind of hard when you can't build, but all the sugar and crap that I ate today is hitting me like a wall. I am crashing hard, so. If you guys like the video, as always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.